I think it is Greg. That fiend. Thank you, thank you for the bevy. I appreciate it. Let's talk to this hey, coward. Uh, Greg. Shall we? Uh -huh. What is it? Do I have toilet paper on my shoes again? Um, uh, one no more about you. Wait up. <laughs> Let's get to know each other. Yeah, you know, I wanna, I wanna know more about you. Like, for instance, why and how are you here right now? Uh, yeah, I had a musculoskeletal disease, had it since birth. Eh, time finally expired at 33. Get him nice and liquored up and he'll spill his guts. Don't be. My oh, sister always boy. says, you don't deserve anything in life but the ability to complain. Look, I'm at the point of the evening where I'm either getting on the expressway to drunken idiocy land, or I'm taking the slow boat to my apartment filled with human-sized cockroaches that watch bad sitcoms in the common area all night. So if, I don't know, you want to play like a drinking game or something, Yes, let's let's do that. Yeah, want to do it? You versus me? Uh, sure. Fuck and Frick yes, yeah, brother. boy, it is so. Yeah, when you talk, it's hard to put liquids down your mouth. So just meet me at the table. Get him nice and liquored up, and he'll spill his guts. Hopefully not literally. You better really hope not literally, because if I get entrails on my favorite overalls, I'm taking it out on your ass. Where's the table? That's it. Okay, we're playing there. Uh, who are you, brother? Hiya. Brrr. You're not, um, pre-med by any chance, are you? Brrr. Thanks for the stirring conversation. By hey, you. Uh, fellow hooligans, what are we watching? <sighs> the carnal malefactors are getting their asses handed to them by the virtuous pagans. Huh. What's the score? It's like soccer. The score doesn't matter until it does, but hey, at least it's boring. Alright, you enjoy that. All right, you know how to play, right? Drink them, rack them, stack them. Highest, fastest, ladder to God wins. I got outdrank by a blacksmith who cheated his knights once. But other than that, I'm go undefeated. Easy on me. Well, on account of my being an alcoholic. Hey, go easy on me. I'm still pretty new at the whole being dead thing. Okay, let's do it. Got your glass? To bad decisions. Kinda empty. To bad decisions. To get new drunk. Ready, set, get wrecked. What am I yeah, doing? Come on, Lola, you're winning. I'm gonna stack them. Okay. I, I understand now. Man, why are you so do I move it? Oh, you, you do move it. Okay. Never mind. I thought we just had to wait for it to go that general direction. I I'm bad, apparently. Go, Lola, let's go. Hurry it up. Come on, Lola, you're falling behind. Don't worry about it. I got it. I got it. This dude's she in, dude. He missed. Whoa. <laughs> good, uh, good game, man. You are you're good at that. God, I, I know. miss that. That that feeling of, of not giving a shit, you know? Of how much I'm... I, I, you can't do it as, as hard when you're well, when I'm alive, because no, the medication. What medication? Musculoskeletal. Yeah, yeah. That's how Doctor Slater. That's how she said it. Pronounced every syllable. But whatever, man. You know, whatever. We're we're all we all got a fucking hourglass over our heads. You know, we're all we're all running on God's time, God's plan. Hey, I'm I'm on the clock here too. Eh, gonna run out soon. <laughs> How'd you how even do it? How did you even? How did you get here? So what, 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 what are you talking about here? Like a portal? Ritual? You sit in a real cold car for an hour? What? I got a... I got a confession to make. I'm not 33. I'm 29. But I know I'm like dead at 33. Like Christ and the fat guy from Blues Brothers. That's what Dr. Slater said. And and I know I'm going to hell, you know? I, I You don't go to the other fucking place by being a pain in the ass like I've been. I never call my mom back and, and I don't talk to my sisters. They don't deserve that, right? But I I like to test the waters by ODing on my prescriptions every once in a while. Just to see what the long haul here will will be like. They always they always bring me back. Eh, it's not And what if you mess up? Huh. But what if you what if you mess up, man? You can't mess up dying, little girl. You can only mess up uh, mess up living and like your bathroom if you miss your toilet i know they're looking for me i've i've done too much shit here you guys are cool right you're you're not gonna turn me in are you i mean 
That wouldn't be. I'm going to turn you away. Nope. <laughs> we need to get the hell out of Dodge, buddy. And you, you picked the wrong prom night. What are you saying? We're turning his ass in, Milo. I don't give a damn what his sob story is. We all got one. And yours is, you tried to outdrink the wrong fucking girl. <laughs> Whatever. Let's see what campus security is gonna do. See you guys. Well, see you guys never. Cause you know, whatever. Later, skater. Uh, uh what do we do? Just leave now? No, no, no. I'm. I, I got two humans working on it. Hey, how's it going? Any luck catching that creep? Because believe me, I am ready for my shift to be over. Yeah, he's it's a guy Greg. named Greg. <laughs> so, you know how that goes. Greg? I was expecting, like, Samuel or something, but <laughs> don't ask me why. Maybe because that's my brother's name? Yeah, best not to think about it. Delinquency department? Right. Yeah, oh. Hi, Jenny. Hi, uh, how you doing? Yeah, good, good. Anyways, we found the Waldo. <laughs> yeah, it's been a night. <laughs> a meat pile named Greg. He's at Feisty's right now. We actually ran out. Yeah, yeah, you know, no, it, it took longer than I thought. It really did. <laughs> Thanks. Say hi to a Dramalek for me. Okay, bye. Shit, I forgot he left her for his podiatrist. Uh, what'll happen to, uh... Oh, nothing much. They'll probably take him and give him a stern talking to, you know, right before condemning them to eternity in the Ninth Circle. Eh, they'll be hacked into infinite pieces by multi-limbed feathered serpents who do <laughs> not fuck around, let me tell you. That's I don't care. Action. Woo. Oh. oh, sounds... yeah. Thanks a lot, guys. This is such... such a big help. Uh, I know you did it just for the invite, but when you get to the party... We should get that drink you promised me you would have with me. Down? Good? Um... If we have the yeah, time. Yes, if we have time. What the fuck? Are you... are you serious? How could you, motherfuckers? Just... Uh, just pretend you can't hear him. I can hear you pretending you don't hear me, you giant asshole! I'm gonna get flayed here! All right, get out of here, you knuckleheads. <laughs> Just uh, drop my name at the entrance and I'll let you in. Thanks again, guys. Bella or whatever your other name is. Because I forgot the other name. <laughs> Got an invite to Satan's phone, fella. Okay. Does this... Oh, switch characters. Does this so taxi work? should we, like, talk about what just... You know, Milo, I... I just don't want to, okay? I'm gonna take a mulligan on this one. I just, I don't wanna think about it, so I'm just not. There are some things that are just beyond. Like, I, I really like chocolate milk. I really like it. And I, and I donated a lot of my time to homeless shelters and animal shelters and money to organizations, and so fuck it, okay? Am I I'm supposed to feel bad? chocolate milk without any pontificating about how the cows are sad and the workers are sad and the truckers that ship it are sad and how the agricultural industry is fucked up in countless ways. and. And so I, I'm just, I, I am chocolate milking this. Sounds good. I don't care at all. Was there a taxi? Let me in. Skirt. No, skirt. No, no, we're good. Wait, I'm a thousand percent sure Inside, that ever since they changed yeah, the black I'm algorithm, a bigger algorithm, our vloggers are losing value. Or a psychological assessment, or bumble feed personality quiz, you know, whatever you want to call it. First of all, you intentionally chose to track somebody down for an unknown and vague punishment instead of genuinely helping a poor soul like Linda, who is, needless to say, now permanently affixed to an eternal misery due to your direct actions. Either you thought this sounded more fun, or Milo likes to just blindly follow Lola around. Which, either way, I mean, I always liked Witchfinder General too. So. You wanted the hell fellow. Hey, it, it wasn't the punishment, okay? I we wanted to help somebody out, fella. Yeah, fella, Linda was just like, buy me a drink. 
Okay, so you heeded the call of justice, but was justice served? Uh-huh. It was. Well, sort of. You picked Greg, who was the hereafter infiltrator. Of course, now he'll never see his family, friends, or help solve the world's energy crisis. I hope it was worth the free house party passes. If you get back, I'd start Give me a break. water if I were you. Ugh, bullshit, Wormhorn. That guy couldn't solve a daily fucking jumble, let alone a... Okay, factoid time. I thought you might want to know what's going on in the land of the living. So while you were busy accomplishing this very important mission instead of, you know, getting your ass off the fucking couch and contributing to society in any sort of meaningful way, a million pounds of chicken nuggets were consumed. Which means oh. half a million pounds of dog food, since, well, that's what chicken nuggets are for the most part. Uh, really? Currently, 3% of fathers are lying about being one. Do you really know who your dad is? Who's to say? Wormhorn. And, of course... Oh, wait, sorry. <laughs> These are out of order. Wormhorn. Oh, you won the drink-off! You alcoholic loser! Who the hell is good at this stupid shit? Get a life! <laughs> I lost the first one. <laughs> get us the hell out of here, Wormhorn. We need to get on with our night before it's over. So? <sighs> Fine. Whatever. I'll text you. I'll talk to you later. I will hope. Skirt. Samantha? What's that backwards path you just did? Someone order a ferry? How did it uh, go with Fella? Um, fine, I guess. We got the invite, so yay. Why the long face? Personal demon dragging you down? Listen, just remember, those things are like car sickness. And sometimes you just need to deal with it to get to the mall, you know? Just keep your eyes on the horizon. It'll go away on its own. Anyways, I saw that janitor, or whatever, post on Vicar. He gave you his invite, didn't he? Yep, we got the invite. We can go to Satan's party without standing in line for a million years. How proud of us are you right now? Uh, not proud at all. I barely know you and care even less. But, wanna head to Welkin Way? See about that party? Heck yeah. Welkin Way. Welkin Way! Go. Let's do it. After me. Every man will have his favorite day, but few will know about them. This will... This should be one of your favorite days, I think. A uh, camel hair better, at least, than bottomless fries Friday. A VIP invitation to Sane's house party, that's, uh... You guys are doing... You're doing well. You, you're doing good. I don't have any poppers or noisemakers. So hopefully the ride, to my supervised. genuine amazement, will suffice. To be honest, I'm even sort of surprised we're actually doing this. I mean, we got the invites. We're gonna be VI goddamn peas at Lucifer's house party. Yeah, something to put on your job applications if you make it back up topside. Oh yeah, when we get back, we'll be like adults. Oh, a little nervous about rolling over from Miss and Mister to Ma'am and Sir. And, uh, depending on your income level, either having to read train schedules or caring about the estate tax? No, it's... it's not... it's not leaving school so much as Milo and I have known each other forever. Yeah, like, genuinely forever. We got paired up in preschool because we were the last picked in the buddy system. And while Milo stayed in town to help his mom in her magic shop. Lola's moving across the country to live with her dad. Sounds like you guys are just erupting with excitement over all the new opportunities afforded by your continued cellular reproduction. Yes, Absolutely. definitely. Uh, Absolutely. Yeah, definitely. So, completely switching topics. Satan's party, huh? Very exciting. Top shelf. Roman Colosseum, Yang Zoo on opium, mother don't look at these pictures and stuff. Put away the Ouija boards and voodoo dolls, kids. Does anyone that be answering is too busy getting their nipples twisted. How about another dollop of helpful advice? This time, actually solicited. Milo, Christ, you don't need advice for how to party. You sound like Sunt Sirdosh. Oh, but if I can't see, will anyone talk to me? Just use your hands and feel around until you get the vodka. Thanks, that's, uh, helpful. Happy to be of service. 
Thank you. All right, candleflies. Have fun. Yeah, enjoy yourselves. Thanks. And uh, before you scamper off, two things, okay? One. Sam, sorry. Are you are you on tonight? For you? Where are you headed? Sixth circle. Lucifer didn't show up for the inspection last week. And now I gotta make sure the stone coffins are being heated properly. Like I don't have enough to so worry looking. about. Yeah, seems like it's a death style now. Wait, sorry, what's your job exactly? Wider ganger, sweat cooker of infidels. This is Milo and Lula, recently deceased. Yeah, congratulations. I'm foreman down at the coffin mines in the city of Diz. We slow roast heretics and serve them with a creamy potato bake along with Brussels sprouts with bacon. I'll get the recipe later. Anyways, can you help me out? I know it's out of the way. I'll give you a ride. Great, thanks. I'd swim. Oh, those two things? The lava starts hurting if you're in it for too long. Wait, Sam, what were your two things? Uh, two pieces of advice? Was I gonna give you two? That seems excessive. How about one? I'll give you one. Do you want to hear the first thing I was gonna say, or the second? Ah, uh, sorry. Second one's always more important. Time for both. Isn't this washing bear? Uh, the second? Don't be intimidated by Morningstar. Satan. He's tall. He's had kings and queens commit atrocities in his name. And you can thank him for the Hurricanes winning the Stanley Cup in 06. But at the end of the day, he's still just a boy. With worries. Um, okay. Text me if you need to ride somewhere. Bye. I think Sam meant by that. He's just a boy with worries. That was a weird thing to say, right? Like, he's probably not just he's insecure. a boy with worries. She's just saying he's probably, like, insecure about something, you know? Like, like everyone has something they're worried about, and it doesn't matter how rich or powerful they are. Oh, like that guy in a nice suit I saw crying on the street after he dropped his taco. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure he has his problems. All right. Next floor, please. Skip the hustle and bustle and head no, I'll take the stairs. I'll take each level. We'll take the long uh, way. The long One way. level at a time. Hey, I'm on your time. Watch your your knees there. Okay, all in. Great. Thank you, sir. I appreciate the ride. We are running, so I doubt there's like anything. But I'm taking the path anyway. Hello, sir. Two organ donors headed up. Thank you, thank you. Part of me coming through. Don't mind me. It's one of those days. I'm a VIP. Neil. Cage is in motion. Head it up, people. One more floor. Let's freaking drink Satan to death. I'm ready. Uh, thank you, thank you. Is that beside peasants? You ever just like real glad you're not alive? God, what a stressful time. Some guy asked me if I wanted to go to Pound Town, and I said yes. Can you go to my house and beat up my idiot husband, please? Invitations, please. Uh, yeah, we're on the list. Uh, fella. I think. Lola Wolf for Fella. He's a little demon security guard. Next. Um, Milo? Uh, I'm under the, the, the same uh, thing. Okay, move along. There's party favors in back, but don't open his fridge. We did, we did it. it. Okay. I guess all that's left is for us to, uh, Enter the party. 
Yes, entering the Lord of okay, Darkness' party is what we are here to do and what we will do. I'm a little nervous. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be fine. We'll be fine. We're here for a thing. We're holding the line up. Do the thing. Yes, exactly. And we'll be fine. So, after you. After me. Um. Hello. Uh, hello. Anyone here? Is this Satan's house where the where the party's at? Does uh, someone want to get that? I'll, I'll try. Oh, it's my house. It's marketers. Hello. You've reached the home of Jean, Barbara, and Milo. Please leave a message with a name and number, and we'll get back to you when we can. Man alive, Milo. Your old man sounds very, very serious. Okay, Sister Mary Worm, asshole. Ha ha. This is my old kitchen. Great. I get it. Oh, I'm so glad. Thank you. Your memory was a little fuzzy. So I had to cobble parts of it together from Marshall Field's display sets circa 1982. Oh, bravo. Oh my God. Where's the party at? Party horn. You know, the whole reason that we're here? Just give it a minute. Give it a minute. Let me do this. It'll take a sec. Lights? No, the other lights. Golly gee, it's a regular old nuclear family with two and a half kids. Minus two of them. Now, when you hear the beep, we all say our names, and that's it. Oh, fine. Wait, who cares about... Shh, 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 shh. Hey, you've reached Jean. Barbara. And I'm Marty the Magnificent. Stop. Say your real name. Say Nothing to be ashamed of, brother. I'm here for you. you were late Marty, six, so Owen, what? Duke, for a week there. Uh, there was the summer of Charlie. Yeah, so what? It took a while for me to get used to to like Milo, okay? This is the seventh try. Oh, he's his mother's son. He's as flighty as she is. You realize this kind of stuff is going to keep you from making friends, right? You have to be comfortable being yourself, not pretending to be something you're but not. But Marty the Magnificent is who I want to be. And Lola's my friend. Lola's a girl. A girl can't be your friend. Do you understand the difference? And see. He's done it. It is what he defied his father. Complicated relationship, okay, Mary? What do you want from me? Wasn't it some TV your show dad's version of a rude boy? Whatever. There's nothing complicated about it, Milo. Your dad's a dick. It's not a. It is that complicated. He just wants me to be happy, and he's trying, okay? He's trying. This is all extremely obvious psycho babble bullshit, Wormhorn. So I don't see eye to eye with my father. That's like a rule hardwired into every animal's DNA. I think even hamsters get into arguments over who gets the last piece of chicken. Maybe. Or maybe he regrets getting you in the divorce instead of his daughter. Because she's a proper lady. And you, Milo, are many things, but a proper man isn't one of them. Fuck off. Just ignore her, Milo. Ignore her. Lola? Are we throwing something again? You're scared. We drove all this way because you wanted to see the carnival. Well, we're here now, and you're gonna hit the damn target. Throw the ball and dunk the clown. We're not leaving until you do. Dunk me, Milo. Dunk me. Throw the ball. Throw it and dunk me. I Christ. freaking missed. Lean in. Move closer. Dad, will you just lay off? I'm trying. Don't embarrass your family in front of all these people. Give me another option. I got it. Son, come on. This isn't I how hit I it. taught you. Throw from the shoulder. Follow through. I'm doing you know this anymore. What? Screw this. I'm not playing this anymore. Huh? And screw you, Wormhorn. My dad, he's not the best. But he's not this total fucking monster you make him out to be. And also, give the guy a damn break. He works like a dog and doesn't speak English that well. Oh, you know, I was gonna try that, but it was super racist sounding. And, you know, <laughs> there are limits. Hey, Milo! Is that you in here? Lola, he's in here! Milo, Jesus! Hi. Who are you, uh, talking to? I thought there were two of you. 
Oh, uh, my personal one of demon. you and somebody else? Oh, just my personal demon, Sister Mary Wormhorn. Oh, yeah. Oh, those things can be real ass -wipes. Milo, oh, God, I'm so sorry. I turned around and it was, uh, I saw a witch doing a keg stand and uh, I didn't know where you were. Are you doing okay? <sighs> no, it's, it's fine. I was fine. fine. Yeah, you, uh, you look, you look good. Where's the booze party? Oh, has awesome. They have a ceiling oh, you in guys, here. <laughs> you guys made it. Hey, I was, uh, you know, I was, I was waiting by the, 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 the latrine. Uh, you been having a good time tonight, fella? I have had a, you know, a few. I have, it's been a, it's been a rough night for old fella here. You know, Dean Bodis, the guy that called you fellatio? Yeah, he, he told his goal director that he cut the interloper, Greg. That it was all that what? That it was all him. He stole all my fucking all the thunder. Dude, I'll vouch for you. <laughs> Everyone's thunder. Hey, no, we can. We should totally vouch for you. We can tell him or or her. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's, fine. it's, fine. it's totally fine. Hey, let me sick me. Tell it, come or sick on. me on him. And the the thing of it is, Bodice, he and I, we let me add him. used to be good friends, you know. We're just good friends. The best friends. I'd drive him to the airport. He'd give my ex-wife free mammograms. And then you just you just keep living, I guess. You just you just keep living. Listen, here's the take my uh, li listen up, listen up right now. Don't trust nobody. Don't care for nobody. Don't act like you care for nobody. Fella. Cause you're just gonna end up some poor. Undersized for his sex demon, sucking hell whiskey out of goddamn ashtrays. Remember that, and remember where I parked my my scooter for me. I gotta ride that shit up at home later. See you in a bit, fella. Man, poor guy. That sucks. I feel so bad for him. Uh, well, cheer up. Hopefully, he just keeps drinking and makes a turn. Brother, I'm Dick sorry with this whole huge platform. I'm trying to make Daddy my home you. here, and you accidentally touched me. That gives me legal party rights to pound you into indiscriminate ash. Hey, he was just trying to get by. Well, you should have tried harder. I'm looking for a stay in, okay? Uh, we're just, just looking for, uh, uh... Hey, so I couldn't remember if you folks wanted Dr. Tibble's Vicoco or Omen Set of Ale. So I just mixed them both together. Oh, hi, Hightower. You wouldn't be attempting to intimidate Messrs. Sangbong and Lola Wolf at my carousal, would you? Because that kind of behavior doesn't really structure well with the pack mentality I'm trying to delicately maintain. No, 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 no. You're angel of darkness. I was. Great. Here. I'll be out on the back patio. I got a terrific snack guy I want you to meet. Ooh. So, that's. that's Satan. Uh, what do I look like? A dictionary? See you, Hightower. Okay, so first impressions. Tall. He knows our names, which I don't like. Also, he smells like a burning courthouse. I thought it was more like a hospital basement. How are we gonna do this? You know, you hear you gotta outdrink Satan a bunch of times, and it sort of just becomes don't something worry. you can do. Don't worry so much, Lola, okay? It's, it's been done before, right? Uh, I'm sorry, but I have this ringing in my ears. It, it sounds like my old math teacher crying. It's been done before? Twice before? All right. So it's like saying I can cut my own hair. <sighs> Let's just talk to him. He seemed reasonable enough. Yeah, I like that guy. No, it's always a great party, Morningstar. I'm having a, a good time. If you're having a good time, Beelzebub, why don't you look like you're having a good time? Uh, I don't know. My face just isn't communicating my interior oh, thoughts. It's definitely communicating. Your head is a master orator. Trust it. Uh, I came here to get approvals. On a thousand Iron Maidens, yeah. Scary. It's okay. You're intimidated by the size of the order. There's a deadline on this. And if we miss the quarter, where are the gluttons going to go? Huh? You want a storm. I can't stock him with the heretics. <laughs> oh, I'm not talking about work, okay? Not tonight. It's not happening. It's the weekend. It's a Tuesday, Luke. And a school night. And I have kids. Yeah, I already saw them. They just left to have a threesome with that conquistador. I honestly, just sign the damn order. If I could, I'd just sign it for you, but I can't do your swooping S well enough. 
Oh, Piso, come on, brother. I'm joking with you. You don't. Uh, he's already gone. And I'm just. Dude, I'm uh, sorry, man. Talking to myself. <clears throat> um, hi. Uh, hi, I'm, I'm Milo, and this is Lola. You know that, uh, of course. Uh, this is a uh, <clears throat> great, great party house you have. Jesus Christ. Shit, I should not have mentioned JC. I'm sorry. I should start over. Uh, hi, I'm Milo, and this is. Albion is sick in America faints. Two more from the colonies. Cultural expats, certainly, but it's okay. We're all immigrants here. Are you having a good time, Milo and Lola? We're, uh, we're having, we're okay having time. A, an okay time, I would say. Right, Lola? Like, two, two out of four stars? Three if it weren't. I just need, like, a good chair, honestly. You should try the snacks. I wasn't in charge of them, but I hear favorable reviews. Hey, I'm sorry to you try. these two dorks, but your real friends are here. Chernobog. Uh, did he bring the pine barons to swim? Because we're running dry and this thing's only like a third over. I didn't ask. Okay, Milo, Lola, walk with me a little. Where's the safe? Don't mind if I do. Bishop. Now's the time to get extraordinarily drunk. Listen. Mr. Safe. You want to ask my permission to leave, and failing that, you want to challenge me to a drinking contest you've heard about, most probably from Sam. How far off am I? So, is the is contest, contest real? real? Like, it seems weird to base it all on that. Hail, Hail Satan! Satan. <laughs> oh, yes, thank you. Uh, uh, keep up the bad work. This whole thing was my idea, yet I can't take full credit. I didn't make the rules. I just created the escape clause for a soul every, you know, thousand years or so. We sing, we drink, we play a few games. It's more fun than doing your laundry, at least. Uh, wait, and God doesn't God, care. Like, he must know about this, so he just doesn't, like, care? Oh, he cares. It has to make enough sense. I couldn't bring you back if you blew yourself up on the six o'clock news. But he also knows, as well as anyone, if you let a little disobedience deflate the balloon a little. It won't one day just go and pop on you. So how does it work exactly? We Great. just- Great, my brother Asmodeus. This is like the eighth text tonight. It's a clip of someone falling downstairs while trying to carry a pumpkin. Eh, I'll just mark it as red. I'm just trying to follow you? Okay. Carl can take a little bit more. Who thinks Carl here can take a little bit more? Where are we going there, Zane? I have another. Just give me a second here. I don't want my buddies to ding dong ditch me. Should I follow? I'll follow. Hey, there it's he the is. the big guy himself. Finally. You look good. You're losing you weight. You know I'm going to make you go home and get it if you forgot. I've got a bottle of chert spit in my pocket, all right. I bless you, my son. Milo, Lola, meet Chernobyl, dark minister of the Seventh Circle. Yeah, hi. Morgan, How do you do? The Black Fiend of the High Seas. Pleasure. Vitala, <laughs> the spirit of disease and intestinal issues. And nice to, you know, whatever. And Chad from Kingston, Ontario. How's it going? Um, oh, no. hi. Uh, hi. Hi. Pleasure to, you know, just to just be here experiencing this. And just think, we haven't even done anything to you yet. I right behind you, big guy. What happened to the uh, bouncer? Come on back. I got the card game set up. Wait, we're just. Well, this will take two minutes. Your your darkliness. We just want to. Oh wait! You're the two that are going to make a run at the big guy, right? Do the drinking contest. <laughs> what? My last shit weighs more than both of you put together. And she had just eaten three people, so... 
Oh yeah, I read about Come you on Vicker. Look. Hey, we're stronger than we look, all right? You, you don't know why we're in hell? We're a scratch and sniff to you. You don't know our, our, our layers. Yeah, we, uh, we could have been strangling bus drivers for kicks on the weekend. Children, look now. I am your humble servant, truly. I worshipped your pores while you were still in the womb. But you don't know what soup you're ordering here. Well, how do we prove we can do this? Who the fuck is texting me right... Oh, good gravy, it's Bezel still on me about those unholy reports. Well, what do you expect? The guy can't turn off. Whoa! Polly was crawling up my butt too tonight. Preaching about that God okay? knows what. Hmm. Actually... Okay, I've developed a notion. Milo, Lola, you can help me out. You can help me out and prove you can handle our little, uh, test of endurance. Interested? Uh, sure, no, what okay, is it? Well, what is it? Track down my brothers and sisters, the original monarchs. Apollon, Esmodius, Beelzebub, Onoskelis, the fallen angels, like me. And outdrink them first. This way Dude, you'll Chad's be granting neck. me a small favor. You'll be getting them temporarily off my behind, while also proving you can party with beings who have used stars as rushlights. And until you do, I'll be playing gin rummy in the parlor. Wait, wait, wait I uh, missed a denominator or something. What do you want us to do? The angels that fought God? They're the monarchs of hell now? And my old pals I used to get shit-faced with and until they turned into a bunch of humorless dicks. Find them, I'll drink them, and I'll give you a shot. All right, well, we made it. It's a golden fiddle? Huh. It says on the plaque that John of Patmos could indeed play very well, but Charlie Daniels made up the rest. Huh, interesting. All right, one more time for anyone whose mother just came in the room and asked them to take out the trash. If you get just two out of four monarch seals of approval on this magical and convenient parchment, then I'll ignore my friends and let you try to, as they say, out party me. But remember what I said. Do try the snacks before you go. Any other queries before I, I get annihilated? Please say no. Very good. Uh, how do we die? Um, how do we die anyway? Unfortunately, that's not my department. I uh, don't shepherd collections. But maybe my sister Polly can assist you with your query. I'll be seeing you. All right. Couldn't just like take us to the taxi. And there the was a lot to unpack there. Those friends of the snacks first. Cox. Seriously, Chad? Like, what the hell was that? Whatever, let's not lose focus. How hard could it be to get two recommendations? I mean, I got five for my college applications, but uh, we have no idea where these monarchs are or how to find them. Oh, you know who would know? Uh, it would probably be Sam, right? Sam. Let's call her cab and ask her about it. Wow. How are you, you guys are party over doing? Good. Thank you. Deary. <laughs> we learned everything we know from Marie Laveau and Mother Suspiriorum. <laughs> and the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil. That was one of the only lines of the Bible I remember from Revelations. Looks like Satan took it as a compliment. Where's the snacks at? Back here? I can go to the right. So, what'd you do to get an invite? I got really into massagers, giving them, getting them. Streamless forgot my uh, extra you know, soy sauce again. It's pushing to grub hubs for good. Better oh, service, way juicier grubs. Hey, you know what's really good for that? A massage. Okay, keep the serving area clear, please. Thank you. A Yanker and a Grammy. How are you two this imperfectly fine evening? Uh, pretty, pretty good. I'm Father Chocoblock, and I'll have the distinct pleasure of serving you tonight. Menu's up top. What do you be starting with? Let's just get Raging Psycho, Evil Genius, 
Liquid Courage, and Liquid Courage. Give me uh, the one of the uh, Great Falls. Great one Falls great should fall be called a win win because they make you both smart and evil. Thanks for the bevy. Now, where are the snacks? And who are you, big guy, huh? Hey. You having a good time? I thought all dogs go to heaven. Uh, yeah, most do, but not Baphomet. That's Satan's prize hunting dog. He used to use him to track down wayward souls, but, uh, typically he just feeds him treats while high now. Sounds more fun, to be honest. Let's keep petting the dog. Pet the dang dog, hey. achievement unlocked. Where's this next site? Oh, whoops. I drink brain. Can I find the snack bar? You know what? That's probably fine. I don't think there's a snack bar. I think you're pulling my chain. Let's just get outside, shall we?